What's up everybody, I'm Vortac and welcome to a brand new game called Drive Any Track. The developer sent me this game I think last week and I just found it in my inbox and man, this is a way different game than anything I normally play on the channel. Normally I'm playing survival games, sandbox games, RTS games, uh, and I don't think I can make a series on this one, but I definitely wanted to show it off because it is worth checking out. So Drive Any Track, the way it works is you take any song you want in your library and that creates a track for you to race on. So there's also all these unlocks too. You can go to the garage and see cars you've unlocked and things like that. Uh, it looks like I have the Photon and uh, I'm, you can customize the cars. I'm not really sure. I haven't delved into all this stuff yet. Uh, but I wanted to show you guys a race with an approaching Nirvana song because they let people use their music on YouTube. That's another thing you gotta be careful about when making videos. Uh, you could, there's also friends and leaderboards and all this other stuff. So let's go ahead and go into new track. I'm gonna go into my music folder. Uh, I have my, uh, approaching Nirvana music stuck in here because I know I can use it on YouTube. And I like the Illusions album. There's a lot of new stuff they've had, but I haven't gotten hold of it yet. Uh, Sugar High I just played. That worked out pretty well, so let's try that. Uh, because you don't have the right ID3 tags, it won't put up a, uh, a score the proper way. So it's best if you have music to go in and add ID3 tags or, uh, you know, make sure you're using music that's fully tagged properly. Uh, so this won't count, I guess. But here we go. All right, so uh, the difficulty is two stars. I haven't picked a very difficult race. And the way the controls work, I thought I would need to bust out a controller, but it looks like, let's just use the pulse. Uh, it looks like you just use the arrow keys to turn and control to drift. So we're just going to follow along. The, the electric line you're seeing right here, I'm going to move my cursor, oops, is the pace line. And I'm not keeping up with it very well, uh, but that lets you know that you're staying in sync with the song. So what happened here is the song developed the track for us. And uh, I'm just going to let you guys enjoy the music, and I'll, uh, I'll talk less than I normally do. How about that? Oops. Oh. Wow. I'm way behind. I'm way behind. Two bars behind. Oh my god. I'm doing worse. You can believe that. Failed drift. No, not again. Keep in mind, this is a two-star track. Those uh, let you unlock uh, upgrades, little coins, square cube coins. Maybe it's those. Maybe those are the coins. So we're approaching the finish line. Uh, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I guess the uh, end of the song kind of tailed off into silence, and that's why the track had no music, but it still kept going. Uh, but there we go. I actually did better. I, last one was like 68% or something terrible. So there we go. That is 
in a nutshell, drive any track. So if you guys want to check this game out, all the links are in the description below. If for some reason you want to see more of this game on the channel, let me know in the comments. I'd be kind of curious. This is very different from what I do normally, so I, I just didn't think it'd make it like a good let's play. But I wanted to show you guys anyway because it's really cool. I love games like this that incorporate music into procedural generation. Uh, it's just really, really cool. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Leave a like if you've enjoyed. Catch you later.